weekend, um, having to delay the match for a day because of inclement weather. Um, talk about the fight that the guys kind of had to deal with adversity with moving the match and then coming away on the road against a, a Richmond team to get three points. Yeah, um, <laughs> being able to uh, you know adapt and deal with adversity, that's part of a pro. Um, the guys did a great job, I think, managing that part of it. Um, emotional intelligence, emotional control, um, not getting too high with the highs, too low with the lows. You know, we really want to keep our team in a mentality state where they're even keeled. And, you know, their performance, you know, on the Sunday afternoon at four o'clock um, was fantastic. And another great, you know, um, I, I think a, a showcase of resilience, you know, a way on the road, you know, like we did in Knoxville, on the road, you know, really good, good performances by some of the guys. And defensively too, I think, you know, we're putting a lot of pressure on our guys to do emergency defending too much. And I don't think, I, I, that's why we are walking through a lot today is, how do we decrease that and increase the percentage of us, you know, being a more efficient team when we go forward. And so uh, trying to get them to be open to that and just discuss, having those real hard discussions, that, that's the key right now. But really happy with uh, the three points on the road, um, you know, again, which is huge. And it just uh, pushes us forward, that much forward. Looking ahead to this weekend, um, this Friday, we play Northern Colorado at home. Talk about, you know, where the team's been working a little bit, trying to transition into that match and see how we can come away with another three points. Yeah, tough team, you know, a team that's, uh, there was one patch in the season where they went four losses in a, in a row. Um, they kind of dug themselves out of that. Um, they've got a leading goal scorer that we have to obviously be aware of with them on. Um, they have guys that can, you know, make those runs in behind and some of their direct ball sometimes service is, is very lethal. So. We have, to, we have to be disciplined and aware of that um, defensively and making sure that we have our shape intact, um, our cover and balance as well. And then, you know, once we, once we win the ball, we have to start being a team that can penetrate them um, and, and go to goal a little bit more instead of doing that extra possession pass out wide. Um, we showed that away from home in the first game, the nil-nil game that I was unable to travel to, uh, that we had probably three good opportunities in the first 16 to 18 minutes. And we hit the post with Lucas Coutinho. We had the same against Richmond. We had two or three opportunities, shots on frame, and one trickle by the post and stuff like that as well. So we just want to be at a point where we bring a little bit more mentality, a little bit more focus, and a little bit like conviction to finish those plays off. Because if you finish those plays off, you're going in at halftime, maybe one nil, two nil up, or three one, whatever it may be. You're converting those chances, big chances, and we want to be in a position to to increase that percentage.